what's going on everybody today we're going to be going over AUD USD and without further ado let's go ahead and get into it all right so first things first let's go ahead and pull up a four hour chart okay I don't like to go past the H4 most times because I don't feel like there's a need to for me and my strategy that is okay, other people might have a difference of opinion but just for this strategy I don't like to go past a four hour. I've developed a theory that lets me trade quite well, and I like to stick to that. All right, so first things first, uh, we see these, it's kind of like a high area here. And sometimes I'll do the tips, sometimes I won't. Like from here, I won't, right? Because I'm trying to get to this bottom one right here, okay? Now, if I went from that bottom, excuse me. Now, if I went from that bottom, all the way to that top it'll be the zone like that which isn't i mean it's not bad but generally speaking i don't like to make my zones uh that big right so boom that's a good zone for me because if it, at this point right here let me show you at this point it's telling me that we have some some structure points right here Two, three, okay. Telling me you have some structure points here, and it's telling me that it was potentially a stop hunt or a inducement or some of some sort up to this level here. Okay, and then a down move happened to where. Let me see. Let me see if I can plug my mouse up for you guys. Give me one second. Alrighty, so now. We can see that the markets come down, come back up, come down, right? And it's hitting this level, as you can see. Okay, right, guys? It's hitting that level. So that's why I kind of like it right there, because I can kind of use my imagination and just say, okay, well, it was a stop point up to that zone. You know what I mean? So, and I'll be okay with that. Now, moving forward, we can bring this over here. And we can bring this down a little bit if we want to. Boom. To about right, to about right there. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and line this up properly. Boom. Now, if we would have had this zone. Let's get our bottom down here as well. Let's get the bottom zone going as well. I don't like the zone to be too big now. Okay? I don't like them too big. Boom. Now, if we would have had that zone down there, boom. This zone up there, boom. Look. It hit the boom, boom. Indeed, one trade could have been there. Mind you, if we would have just had that. And look. Boom. Boom. Okay. We would have had this play right here to go off of. And we would have had this play right here going the other way. Easy money. Easy money. H1. Let's go to the H1C entry. Okay. We see how the markets come up come down made people think that it was going to be a down move from here it made it this right here made people think that okay it may not reach the zone no it's always going to reach the zone no okay so boom it started to go back up okay it's always going to reach the zone always boom and now what do we have we have a inducement we have a all right stop point inducement we have something like that okay we got this we got the inducement and then we have a what a retracement after the inducement okay we got one and we got two retracements that we could have got into and we had one two three four five hours to get into that trade before we seen this major drop boom which gave us 125 pips 
Okay, five hours we could have before that major drop right there. Okay, and that's how we would catch that. Now look here. Okay, what do you think is going to happen here? Okay, let's get let's get all this out the way. What do you think is going to happen here? Okay. Boom. For me, I'm guessing that this may be an inducement. Okay, that's what I'm guessing. After after the market's going in a long direction for a certain amount of time, you could bet your tailbone that it's going to be a inducement play coming up next. Okay, now this market's come up 140 pips. It's inducement time. Okay, same thing with this. The market's going down 100 and 200 pips. It's inducement time. Okay, that's what this is right here. Okay, inducement. Boom. All right. Got that, that, that. Now I'm looking for the market to dance around, dance around, dance around. Inducement, come back up and hit them with a retracement of some sort. Maybe one, maybe two retracements, who knows? But I need to see the retracement and then boom, we taking off. Okay, you know that's A U D U S D. And you will you will potentially trade this the same way with any pair. Okay, they pretty much all work the same. All pairs. All right. This A U D U S D. Training coming soon. I'm working on training. Uh I've got a few questions about when I'll be releasing the Demigod FX training course. I'm actually working on it. I want it. I want it to be perfect for you guys. So I'm working on it and perfecting it so that uh, you guys won't have any type of serious questions after going through the course. You'll be able to apply what you, whatever you learn in the course and implement it straight on the charts right away, guys. So that's what I'm working on for you guys. Uh, training coming real soon, real, real soon, guys. I'm, I'm hearing your questions and uh, your answer is the training is coming soon, guys. Super, 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 super soon, guys. All right, guys. So until the next video, peace. I'm out.